Guten Tag and welcome to Lyle's Itch, the series where I, Lyle from Dragon's Zeta Name, play indie games from itch.io and see if I like them. They are free indie games and the link to the game as always will be in the description down below. Today we are playing Soul Void, which is a game that has piqued my interest on numerous occasions when I went through the tag the free game tag on itch.io. My only problem is that it looks a little bit like it's a horror game. And if you have watched this channel for a while, then you know that I am not good with horror. But I still want to want to try and see what Soul Void is about. As far as the description goes, it is a, a an adventure story game, as I understand it. And I think we should just go in. Okay, there's no music playing. I don't know if that is correct. Oh. Okay, I can run. Is that death? Am I dead? Can I just... Alright. I'm just gonna run by you. Bye bye <laughs> Here closed until fur further notice. Okay. Uh. That's, uh, we are just having a look around. I have no idea what will be expected of me. Oh, there's a... There's a creature guy. Hi. What to do with a drunken sailor? What to do with a drunken sailor? What to do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? I don't know. What are we going to do with the drunken sailor early in the morning? Alright, the drunken sailor didn't really help me though, so... Let's just go right here. I still feel like there should be music playing. Should there be music? It doesn't have music, so I will put something... Maybe creepy? I don't know yet. Under here. Okay, who are you? I'm so scared. I'm scared. It's so dark here. Someone told me I'd be okay. If I just kept going forward. But there's nothing out there. What if I get lost? These flowers seem much safer. Maybe I'll follow them instead. So I can follow the flowers or just go? Let's, let's try that, because that's just how I roll, I guess. Ding, 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 ding. See? There is something. Something here. The distance between the swamp and the town isn't really that big. But to some, it's overwhelming. Maybe they just need a little confidence boost. Alright, so is this the swamp? I also don't know what I what I'm supposed to do. I know that this game is supposedly like an hour to two hours long, so I will not be able to do everything in one episode. You are a bright person and not a dark person. Just give me a sign. Any kind of sign, please. What sign do you, it's locked. All right. What sign do you want? F and a sign for what? To what? I can go in here though. There's a dark person again. You know, the void isn't meant for the dead. Sometimes souls just get lost here on their way to wherever they go. There's not many of them around the town or swamp. But be careful if you keep going east. The void's plenty weird itself. And the longer a soul stays here... What happens the longer a soul stays here? Oh, I can just run over your bed. Sorry. More people. I used to take walks to the swamp, but not anymore. I saw some lost soul that had turned into an eyeball. Freaked me out some something fierce. I'm staying where it's safe here. I'm staying where it's safe here. Alright. Hey, you new here? You're not a lost soul, are you? 
Either way, you should probably go talk to the mayor. I am a lost soul, so I did die. That's what the creature that in the beginning was. I kind of wish there was more to do in town. I guess I'll just walk around this grass pa patch for a while. That's an NPC sentence if I ever heard one. Ugh. What are those? Oh, hi. This looks weird, doesn't it? Listen, they just showed up one day. Ate all of my furniture, my wallpaper and the light bulb too. But still, I can't bring myself to get rid of them. They are endearing in a way. Are they? They are just mouse? I don't find that very endearing. Okay, there are... Beep beep! Cheep cheep! They all make different sounds. What do you make? Sup, dude! <laughs> awesome, nice. Ugh. 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 Whoa. Hey, careful where you step. My wife's taking a nap. Don't uh, tell anyone she's here, okay? Your wife is black ten tentacles with four arms? I don't know. Um, I don't think that's normal. But, you know. Okay, I could go down here, I think. There's another person in the swamp. Can I not go there? Apparently not. But more houses. The scouts and researchers beyond the town are way braver than I am. I can't imagine spending all that time in the soul void, even if we aren't affected by the void's uh, transform me properties. Hmm. A transformative properties that void has, huh? Right, so I'm guessing I have to follow this street then? Whoops. Another birdie. Caca! Caca, motherfucker. Beep beep. I tried to keep a sprite as a pet, but it was way too much work. Birds are much nicer, anyways, and they don't try to eat my stuff. <laughs> Our son works. Uh, the beyond la in the beyond lands is that something like Disneyland just for souls? If you happen to see him, could you please give him this letter? You obtained a mother's letter. All right, sure. We used to have a bat uh, boatman who transported supplies and letters between the town and the outposts in the beyond lands, but he was a lost soul. Eventually, the void got to him. Now he just sits in the bo boathouse, singing the same song over and over again. So was that the drunken sailor guy? No items, just garbage, fine. Oh, I can go on here too. Alright. Sometimes hand vines grow over the entrance to the soul void, separating our town from it. It takes the scotus a bit of time to cut them down, but I don't mind. It's not like I'm going out there myself. It's locked. Alright. Mayor's office farm. Soul void swamp. We should go to the mayor's office. That was what we were told, so we are going there. Because I'm a stickler for rules. I'm German. Looking for the mayor? She's just up ahead. Thanks. Oh, you have some sort of character. Hello there. I assume you're the newcomer. Word travels fast around here. And you've caused quite the buzz. Why? As the mayor, I welcome you to our town. I'm sure you have a lot of questions, but unfortunately I don't think I can answer them. We are still not sure why souls are drifting here, let alone an outvoider like you. All we know is that eventually lost souls turn into something terrible, something not like themselves. It's been some time since they showed up, 
and some are still normal, but many, I le many leave town to seek answers. I wish I could say they moved on, but we know that's not the case. We have outposts in the beyond lands, and our scouts bring back horrific news. I think I recently read scouts as scotus. Well, and beyond, the beyond lands have become a dangerous place, and some locals have started calling it the soul void. Instead, given the lost that wander through its shifting darkness. It is my job, first and foremost, to keep my people safe. So I've forbidden any non-approved persons from going to the Soul Void. But if you wish to find a way home, the Soul Void might be the only way to go. You're welcome to stay here, but I understand if you decide to pursue the Soul Void. Look for our outposts if you need guidance. Perhaps they can help you more than I. All right, thank you, Mayor. Um, probably just gonna go do that because I want to know where I belong. I guess if I am a lost soul. All right, buddy, you're all clear. Hope you know what you're in for. Thanks. I don't think I do, but I will still go on. Gee hee hee hee. Gee hee hee. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> Holy crap, that's a freaking... That's a mouth and two eyes. And a lot of teeth. Oh my god. I'm kind of glad now that there isn't any music. So, you are going into the soul void all by yourself. What do you think you'll find? Help? A way home? The answers you seek? Well, guess what? Many have tried before you, and they all failed. <laughs> so go ahead and try, girly. Try and fail, and try and fail. I can't wait to watch you fall. Stumble, wither, and and rise. Good luck out there, girly. <laughs> that was not nice. Do you kill me? Do you do anything? Apparently not. Alright. You're just a... plant, I guess. Hey, I want, I want, I want, I want, I want. I want, I want, I want, I want, I want, I want. What do you want? So, tell me what you want. <laughs> Probably get copyright striked for this. But where am I? Where am I? Oh god, am I lost? Am I lost? Okay, these aren't as friendly as the ones in the town. Or as... aware, I guess. There's a big hand that I didn't even see. Now I see it. There's a big hand. Alright. We will make our way downtown anyway. Not enough. It's not enough. What is not enough, friend? Hand vines block your way. It's always at my fingertips, but I can never hold on to it. Happiness, peace. Why can't I have them? I don't know. Ah, ah, ah. I just want something pretty, something pretty. Is that so bad? Why can't I feel pretty? I don't know, you're a, a weird looking vine for now. Ah, okay, I can go on here. Oh god, this is getting real creepy. What are these? Nothing matters, just go back. No one cares, just give up. Life is hard, keep pushing forward. Okay, there are two, two who want me to give up and one who is encouraging question mark I want to go forward but I can't I don't know I don't think I can oh yes I can where the flower is I can there's another of these weird mouse things the sprite sticks its tongue out at you oh thanks Ooh, what's this 
I am a part of the void, bound to its waters that nonsensically flow through the land. I know this to be true, little one. The soul void is not all torturous. It pulls from the heart, the mind, the soul. It sees the good, the bad, but it often feels as if the bad stays longer than the good in our minds. So the void takes from it more easily. Do not forget the good, little one. Hold on to the light. I will try. All of this seems a little bit uh, like a metaphor for maybe depression. Or something. Feels like it at least. I'm guessing that where the flowers are, it goes on. Yeah, alright. I at least understood that now. Okay, hi. Exclamation point. <laughs> well, this is unexpected. And an outvoider, a human. A human, but not a lost human soul. Oh, this isn't very good, is it? The stranger mutters something and writes a note in his book. Oh, 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 you look like a film noir uh, guy. Pardon, let me introduce myself. I've forgotten my real name, so you can call me the Seeker. I seek answers, just like you. More importantly, I'm trying to help the other, the lost souls here. I've been doing research on this place, its residents and its displaced souls, so most of my time is spent here, in the soul void. It's an odd, unsettling place, but I endure it for my research. You see, I have a theory and... The seeker pauses. Would you mind if I put a hand on your shoulder? I can read emotions that even you may not be aware of, but only through physical contact. Doing this could validate my theory and my worst fears. After a second of hesitant thought, you give a nod and the seeker places a hand gently on your shoulder. Almost immediately, his eye grows wide with shock. Oh, oh no, I'm so sorry. I understand why you're here now, how you are here. This is bad, this is very bad. I, okay, okay, listen to me. If we work together, we can... <coughs> Oh, oh no no no. Oh, you, I don't like you. I don't like you. Not so fast, Seeker. You've been a pain in my side ever since you showed up. I've entertained your pathetic research for long enough. It's time I forced you to give up. And you, girly. I'm not done with you yet. We've barely even started. So play dates over, you worms. Say goodbye. <laughs> Alrighty, I have no idea where I am and I think I will leave it here on a cliffhanger. This is pretty interesting. It's a little bit sad that there is no music and, and no, uh, no sounds, but just from the text and from the visual style, I think it's really, really cool. I know it's not that long, so please tell me if you think that I should finish this, because I, I would be interested in, in going at it for a bit of a longer time and, and maybe see the story to its conclusion. So if you like it, you can either tell me to continue to play it or you can play it for yourself on itch.io. I will leave, as I said, the, li the link is in the description down below. So you guys, have a wonderful Sunday. I love you all very much. Stay safe, stay healthy. Bye bye und auf Wiedersehen.